Hey, this is James Glass, and I'm here with Tina Kazee, who's filming, and the boys are watching TV. And I wanted to show you how to edge um, paint to the ceiling, or anything really, just doing two different paint colors. No need to tape, taping is a waste of time, just learn how to do this, and life is great. First, you need to start with the right equipment, then you need to get the right amount of paint, and then you need to apply it just so. I'm going to show you those three steps. The right equipment is a sash brush. It's a brush with a little angle on it. It's not, the, it's not 90 degrees. You need some kind of a pail or bucket. I happen to have this one. It has a nice little handle on it, so you can hold on to it. Just put about an inch or so. I don't know if you can see that. You don't need much paint in the bottom, just about an inch or so. So you gotta start with this. Now you gotta use the right amount of paint. So dip the brush in about a quarter of an inch, no more. And I don't know if you can see that, but you know, just a little bit on the end. And then tap the sides of the bucket to knock off any excess paint. Bring this up to the wall. You're going to be holding the brush at a, if this was 45, you're going to be holding the brush at about a 30 degree angle. Tap off a little extra paint right there. I'm going to show you what to do with that in a second. Then come up to your edge and just walk it right along. Get the most amount of paint on the edge. Don't worry about anything else. Now, once you've done that, take the paint that you tapped off and feather it into what you rolled and you have a perfect line, no taping. So, to review, start with the right equipment, then get the right amount of paint on it, put it on at the right angle, make sure you knock off that extra little bit to kind of pull it right here, drag just the right amount across the edge, and then feather it all out so there's no brush marks. The, the final thing is, remember how I said make sure the edge is plenty painted? You're probably gonna to wanna to come back, even with the best paints, Pratt & Lambert, whatever, top of the line, <clears throat> any paint usually requires a second application of edging. If you focus your edge and get that real crisp and tight, you won't have to edge the second time. When I come back the second time, if it's a little light here, I'll just really fast go ch -ch 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 right by there. So I'll let this dry for an hour or two and then come back and do a second coat to make sure it's super clean. But I've already made that super nice edge on the first pass and I won't need to redo it. So there you go. That is how you edge. And that's how you get a really crisp line. Don't waste your time on Hammerstick. Hey, thanks for watching.